Well, Susan, first let me say that progress has been made. Take a look behind me. County crews have been cleaning this area, and thank goodness there is no more raw sewage flowing down the street in this neighborhood. But let me tell you, it was really bad. Take a look. Somebody clogged the toilet and is going through our street. Carson residents couldn't believe their eyes on Thursday afternoon. Raw sewage spewing from a broken line, feces, toilet paper, all of it flowing down the 300 block of West 212th Street. The smell was unbearable. Millions of gallons of untreated sewage then spilled into the Dominguez Channel, which empties into the L.A. Harbor. Now, because of that, several beaches have been closed since Thursday. You do not want to swim in that disgusting water. The closures and include Rancho Palos Verdes, Beach at Portuguese Bend, Royal Palm Beach, White Point Beach, Wilder Edition Park Beach at Point Furman, and Cabrillo Beach. You're asked to stay out of the water until all of that sewage has been cleaned up. Now back here live, county crews have completed what uh, the cleanup here where the sewage line originally busted and joining me is one of the residents Cesar Casillas he's the one who sent us that video I, I, it, I don't even know what to say it was horrible it was very horrible it was a scary scene coming home and seeing all that raw sewage just coming down your neighborhood street and having to drive over, over it to get home because at first we didn't know what it was until we got home and we smelt it and then we got off and we see it something you don't want to see ever and I understand this is not the first time this has happened that's correct this happened about five years ago it's gonna be five years January 22nd 2017 I remember it clearly exact same location the manhole busted open raw sewage was spewing out um, I would think they would learn from the first time to prepare themselves for anything like this in the future and as you can see they didn't prepare enough I guess because it was worse the second time around and you know you're you're glad that they're doing the cleanup, but there's still a slingering smell, and you're talking about some of the stuff we're seeing on the grass here. Yes, uh, you get that distinct smell when you get waves, when the air picks it up, and you can see clearly there is still um, toilet paper smudged into the soil. Um, it's deep, penetrated deep inside, and my children can't play out here. Uh, it, I don't think it's safe. It needs to be uh, uh, better cleaned up. Well, thank you so much for speaking with us and giving us that cell phone video. Yeah. And again, I'm sorry that everybody here in this neighborhood had to go through that. But at least there's the light at the end of the tunnel. The crews are here and hopefully they'll fix it so that it doesn't happen again. I'll send it back to you guys in the studio. All right, Gina, thank you very much. And you're right. Oh, gosh, what a thought.